Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. So it's Pearl again. So today I will be teaching you another tutorial and that is how to jailbreak your iPhone. So for iPhone users, grab your phone now and let's get started. So as usual, we don't go right away to our tutorials for just an FYI what is a jailbreak. So when you say that you jailbreak the phone, that means that you are freeing the phone from the set limitation of the manufacturer. So for iPhone, that is the Apple. And also a jailbroken phone lets you customize the phone's appearance up to installation of third-party applications. So I think that's enough for the introduction of jailbreak. So let's get started with the process on jailbreaking your iPhone. So as you can see guys, again I have my iPhone 6s Plus here. So it's not yet jailbroken. You cannot see that Cydia is installed and there is no customization. So the first thing that we need to do is to check the iOS version of your iPhone, if it is supported or not. So for the iOS version, the supported one would be the iOS version 1.12.1.3 uh, to 12.2 with A9 to A11 processor. So in checking the iOS version, um, we just need to go to our settings. So under settings, go to general and then go to about phone. And then there you will see that my phone's version is 12.2, so that means it is supported. So if you're above the 12.2 version, I suggest that you stay in that version and then wait for the version to be supported. So for any, you know, unintentional upgrade on your iOS, then you can install the tvOS 12. So it will not install right away. So I'll teach you how to do it. You can go to your Safari browser, please. So under the Safari browser, just type in betaprofiles.com. Okay, there you have it. So you're now on the page. Then scroll down and then just download the tvOS 12 for all iOS version. So a pop-up download will actually appear. So just hit download anyway. Always allow pop-up. So guys, you need to always allow pop-up and then profile download. Just close it after that. And then let's go back to our main screen. Okay, so under main screen, just go to your settings and then go to general. So what we're installing right now is an entrusted application. So we need to enable it on the phone. So again, go to general and then go to profiles and device management. Okay, there you see it, the tvOS 12 beta. So just hit install, that's in the upper right corner. So it would require a passcode, so it's the passcode of your phone if you do have one. All right, and then after that, just install again. Okay, so it would require your phone to restart. Just click on restart and then let it restart itself. Just wait for a couple of seconds. So now the phone has restarted, then let's try to open now Safari. And then please type in ignition.fun. After that, just click install. And then install the ignition, just install it. Okay, do you have it? It's complete. So let's try to open ignition. So in the ignition, guys, you see there are a lot of buttons at the bottom then just click on the second button okay so you have a lot of options there then just click on jailbreak okay that's it you're doing good okay so after clicking jailbreak then just install uncover 3.3.0 beta okay just go on with the process just click install Okay, let's go back to the main screen. So I think it's already installed, so let's try to open and cover now. So guys, in here, this would be the first or the main process in jailbreaking the phone. So we're at actually the first step. There would be two steps in jailbreaking the phone, and this is the initial one. So now open and cover, and then click on jailbreak. That's what you get at the bottom part of the screen. After clicking that, the device would require to restart. So just again, restart. Well, it's up and running now. So 
let's now open and cover again. And this would be the second process in jailbreaking the phone. So you see there the jailbreak um, button and you need to again click that. That's for the final part of jailbreaking. That's the final part of the process. Okay, see, so there you will see that it's running just like we're hacking a you know, very big website. <laughs> okay, just like a pro hacker. That's what you can see on the screen now. So it's still running. We have the, uh, the update that's 22 over 31. So let's just wait until it completes. And then after that, we're able then to hack. Okay, well, I think it's done. It's done now. So jailbreak completed. So just click on OK and device will, the device will actually re-screen. Okay, so when you go to the main screen there, you will see that the CDA has been installed already. Now we have the CDA here, which means that our phone is already jailbroken. So let's try to open CDA. For the first timers, there on the screen, you can see the Cydia interface. Okay, that's it. That's how Cydia looks like. So let's try some, set. let's try to, you know, test here the application. Well, then I think it's up and running and it's properly working. So now let's try to install a tweak, the snowboard. So guys, for the snowboard, it's actually an application where we can Customize the theme of the phone. All right. So in the upper right or in the search bar, just type in the snowboard. And then you click on the yellow icon. For the yellow icon, that's actually like, um, that's the picture. Uh, that's actually how it looks when the application is a tweak. So click on the yellow icon. And then in the upper right, you have there the option to modify. Just click that. Modify or install and then just confirm it. Now wait till it's done. Let's wait till it's done. So after that, the spring or it would actually restart the spring boy. So let's try to open CD again. And this time let's try to um, download a theme and to see if it's really working with the snowboard that we had earlier. Okay, let me try the Muse 4, because I really like this theme. I had my phone jailbroken before. So right now, install, again, just install and then confirm the installation. It's downloading the package right now, so let's just wait again till it's done. So waiting here is such the key ingredient. <laughs> okay. Okay, return now to Cydia. Back to the home screen, please. Now let's try to activate the theme that we just downloaded. And it would be the usual process in changing the theme. Just go to your settings. And then under your settings, just look for Snowboard. Okay, there you have it. So just open the Snowboard. There you will see that it's enabled. And you have there the option to select theme. So just click on that. So you have there the option enabled and disabled. So if you wanted to enable the theme, then you just have to drag it up. So let's drag it up here. My selected theme. So I have here the news for. Okay. That's done. Let's go back to the main screen and let's see if it's changed. Okay, guys. So now you can see on your screen that the icons are actually changed with you know with the um, default one however you can see on the other icons that they were not replaced but that's not a problem we do have an option for that so for those unreplaced icons the thing that we need to do here to have it modified is just long press the icon just like what i'm doing now and then after that double click the icon to enter the alternative icons after that, click all icons in the bottom. There you have the different icons that you can use. Then you can just select which one you want to use. And for the remaining icons that were not changed, then you can just do the same process. 
again, it would be long press, click the icon, alternatives icon will show up, and then just select your preferred one. So guys, that's the complete or the whole process in jailbreaking your phone. So as you can see, it's not really that hard. What you need here is just to wait and then just follow the instruction. <laughs> So again, guys, I hope that I was able to help you with what you're looking for here in YouTube. And please, if you do find me here helpful, then hit like and subscribe. And you can turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified if I have some other videos that you might want. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you. Bye.